First of all, turn on the power and enable Pack-a-Punch at least once and shoot the wisp that spawns above it that leads you to the firing range. Keep shooting it as it moves to different targets and it will spawn onto you a key that you can use to unlock the two doors either side of the underground bunker area. Wait until a Mimic spawns underground with you and lead it into the laboratory where you opened earlier and into the glass box. Interact with the control panel next to it to begin the lockdown that you must then survive. Interact with the panel again to collect the blood, place it into the machine found in the nuclear room that we opened on the other side and four orbs will then spawn around the map that you must shoot with the corresponding elemental bows. The fire orb is found at the rice paddies, the lightning is found in the caves, the poison orb is found at the communal hut and the ice orb is found at the waterfall. Next you'll need to grab the canister from the helicopter crash site and place it onto the ether orb found now in the spawn area and fill it up with souls. Make sure that you've grabbed one of the four buckets found around the map and then take the filled canister and deposit it into the machine found in the nuclear room. With haste, fill your bucket with coolant from the bottom of the caves like you did for Pack-a-Punch and place it into the same nuclear machine before the timer runs out. Next, interact with the marked panel in the same room, survive the final lockdown and then head to the war room to launch the missile. All players will then receive all perks, the golden helmet can be claimed from the spawn and the Bible ending will become available for 50,000 points. I want to thank you all for watching, cheers.